Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Ravella Design. Today I'm gonna show you how we are going to make these beautiful and very easy crochet web spider gloves. It is really beautiful dear friends. It is nice for Halloween team parties or any other parties you can wear these. It is very cute, very lovely. And the pattern is also very easy. I explained in my video very detailed. Okay, dear friends, let's go on seeing how to make this. Meanwhile, please remember to subscribe my YouTube channel, activate the info bell. Please leave like remarks and make comments and share my video. Thank you so much, dear friends. Let's go on how to make this. For this project, I am using this acrylic yarn. It is double ply yarn. It is thin, dear friends. It is not thick. Since the glove is lacy, uh, it should be thin. Maybe uh, if you cannot find this kind of double ply yarn, you can make one ply yarn. It's no matter, but it should be thin. And I am using two millimeters hook. We are starting by making magic ring. I am doing magic ring like this. And making one chain to fix it. Now I am going to make five chains. One, two, three, four, five. And then I am going to make double crochet. Now we are going to make two chains. One, two, yarn over, we are making a double crochet. We are making two chains and making a double crochet. Making two chains and making a double crochet. It's been one, two, three, four, five. It will be totally eight double crochet, dear friends. We are considering the first five chains as first double crochet, two, three, four, five. We are going to make two more double crochets. There will be totally eight double crochet around the ring. It's been totally eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now we are going to close this ring. I am pulling the yarn end, pulling tightly, it's been closed, it's been like this. Now we are going to close this ring. For this reason, first of all, we are making two chains and then one, two, three. We are inserting our hook in the third chain, yarn over, pull through and slip stitch. And the first round is finished. Now we are making nine chains. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two times yarn over. We are inserting our hook at top of the first the following uh, double crochet like this and making a treble crochet. Two by two, I am making pull through, like this. Now we are making five chains. One, two, three, four, five. Two times yarn over. After making uh, two times yarn over, I am inserting my hook at top of the following double crochet and making a treble crochet. Making five chains, one, two, three, four, five, two times yarn over, inserting our hook at top of the following double crochet this one like this making five chains one two three 
four, five. Two times yarn over, inserting our hook at top of the following stitch. Like this, we are coming to the end, dear friends. We are coming to the last uh, double crochet and we are completing this row. I came to the end. Now I am making five chains. One, two, three, four, and five. I am inserting my hook uh, in the fourth chain. One, two, three, and four. yarn over pull through making a slip stitch and we closed we finished the second row now we are making 12 chains 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 two times yarn over going to the following treble crochet and inserting our hook at top of this treble crochet we are going to make a treble crochet here three times pull through we are making two by two it's been like this now we are making eight chains one two three four five six seven eight two times yarn over going to the following treble crochet inserting our hook at top of this one and making a treble crochet eight chains one two three four five six seven eight two times yarn over and making a treble crochet like this we are coming to the end here dear friends i came to the end of this row i am making eight chains one two three four five six seven eight and inserting our hook in the fourth chain one two three four here and slip stitch this row is finished we are making 15 chains one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen two times yarn over inserting our hook at top of the following uh, treble crochet and we are making a treble crochet like this now we are making 11 chains 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 two times yarn over inserting our hook at top of the following treble crochet we are making treble crochet like this 11 chains again 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 two times yarn over going to the following treble crochet inserting our hook at top of this one yarn over pull through two by two we will make pull through and we are going to make a treble crochet in here one two three times 
making pull through and making a treble crochet. Like this, dear friends, we are coming to the end. I came to the end, I made 11 chains and I am inserting my hook in the fourth chain. One, two, three and four. Inserting our hook in there, yarn over, pull through and slip stitch. And this row is finished as well. Now we are making 13 chains. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen. After making 13 chains, we are making two times yarn over and inserting our hook at top of the following treble crochet. Two by two, we are making pull through and making a treble crochet in here. It's been like this. We are making 13 chains again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Two times yarn over. Going to the following treble crochet, inserting our hook at top of this one and making a treble crochet like this. We are making 13 chains again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Two times yarn over, going to the following treble crochet, inserting our hook at top of this one and making a treble crochet in here. Like this. We are making 13 chains again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 10, 11, 12, 13, two times yarn over, going to the following stitch, inserting our hook at top of this one and making a treble crochet. Like this. We are making 13 chains again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. This time we are going to go go to the following treble crochet inserting our hook on top of this but we are making slip stitch like this. We are making 13 chains again. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Going to the following treble crochet, inserting our hook at top of this one, and we are making a slip stitch in here. Like this. We are making slip stitch. We are making thirteen chains again. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Going to the following treble crochet, inserting our hook at top of this and making a slip stitch in here. Like this. Again, we are making thirteen chains. One, two, three, four, five. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 and inserting our hook in here and making a slip stitch and finishing this row and this row is finished dear friends like this we are on the upper row first of all we are making 25 chains one, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, two, three, four, and twenty five. Like this. And then going to the following treble crochet inserting our hook at top of this one yarn over pull through making a slip stitch it's been like this now we are making 15 chains 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 and 15 two times yarn over going to the following treble crochet inserting our hook in there and making a treble crochet in there like this now we are making 15 chains 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 two times yarn over inserting our hook in the following treble crochet at top of this one and making a treble crochet in there it's been like this we are making 15 chains 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Going to the following treble crochet, inserting our hook on top of this one, and this time we are making slip stitch like this. We are making 25 chains now. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, and 25, like this. And we are going to the following stitch, inserting our hook in the middle of this, yarn over, pull through, making a slip stitch, like this, dear friends. It's going to be like this. Of course, it hasn't finished yet. When it's completely finished, it's been more beautiful. We finished making the rows like this. We are making one chain, one more chain to fix well, and we are cutting the yarn. Yes, dear friends, it's been like this. Uh, I will hide this yarn end. I also hide this yarn end in the back. I will show you how I am doing this. I am taking a small size hook in my hand and in the back side I will make this yarn end pull through. One moment. A few times we are doing this and we are hiding the yarn end in the back side by this way. Okay, we are cutting the yarn. It is like this, dear friends. As I told you, I hidden the yarn end in the back side before uh, making this video. Uh, yeah, uh, hide the yarn ends in the back exactly the same way as I did here. 
Now we are going to make this side. Look, dear friends, these are the sides that we make uh, single stitches, and these are the sides that we make a uh, triple crochet. Not this one, not this one, here. Here, we are going to make 15 chains by fixing our yarn like this. First of all, we are fixing the yarn like this. I am doing it in order to fix it well. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. According to the size of my wrist, uh, I am going to make twenty, dear friends. It's been fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. When making the chain, please adjust it uh, according to your uh, size of your wrist uh, and then decide how many chains it is suitable for you. Uh, first of all, I made 15, but later on I saw 15 is not enough for my wrist, so now I'm making 20 chains. After making 20 chains, we are cutting the yarn. I am making one more chain to fix the chain and then cutting the yarn. We are finished with this now. Uh, before making the chains at the other side, uh, it is better to hide the yarn ends for now. For this reason, I am taking the smaller hook in my hand again and in the back side I am hiding this yarn end. A few times we are doing this. Making a knot and cutting. It's been like this. And here we are making 20 chains more in the same way I did here. Again, I'm taking my yarn in my hand. First of all, I am fixing the yarn in there. Like this, we are making 20 chains, dear friends. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's been 20 chains, dear friends, like this. After making 20 chains, I am keeping my finger here in the 15th chain and upon this, we are making six more chains. One, two, three, four, five, six, like this. Dear friends, we are making six more chains. It's been, it's been now 26. Now I am making two times yarn over and inserting my hook in the 20th chain here. And making a treble crochet. Two by two, I am making pull through three times. This is one time pull through. This is second time pull through and this is the third time pull through like this now we are making two chains one two two times yarn over we are making one chain two chains skipping inserting our hook in the third chain and making a treble crochet one, two, three. Two chains making, two times yarn over, skipping one, two chain, inserting our hook in the third one. And making a treble crochet. 
like this, we are coming to the end, dear friends. Yes, I finished the treble crochets at this side. I am at the end of this 20 chains. Now I am going to make 7 chains. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. 2 times yarn over. I am counting 7 chains also here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. I am inserting my hook in there like this and making a treble crochet in here. 2 by 2, this is 1, this is 2 and this is 3 times pull through. Making 7 more chains, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7, 2 times yarn over and making a treble crochet also here in the starting place of this 20 chains. I mean here. Making a treble crochet in here like this. I am making two chains and I am doing the same thing exactly what I, what I did here in the side. I mean, uh, I am making, I am counting one, two chains, skipping these two chains, inserting our hook in the third chain and making a treble crochet in there. Like this, making two chains, two times yarn over, one, two chains skipping, inserting our hook in the third chain, like this, making a treble crochet in there, like this, dear friends. And by this way, we are coming to the end, dear friends. I finished also this side, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, it's been. I am counting here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and this is the 8th one. We are doing the 8th one like this, making 2 chains, 2 times yarn over, and I am inserting my hook in the same place that I make the 7th chain. Like this, making a treble crochet. It is finished like this, dear friends. Now I am making six chains. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Turning back two times yarn over and making a treble crochet here. Like this. Like this. It's been like this, dear friends. Now I am making two chains, two times yarn over, going here, making another treble crochet, two chains making, two times yarn over, like this. 2 chains making, 2 times yarn over, 1 by 1 we are making treble crochets on top of the treble crochets of the previous row.
Yes, it is finished like this. Now we are making seven chains. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Two times yarn over. I am inserting my hook here. Making a treble crochet in here. Seven chains, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Two times yarn over. Here, inserting our hook. Making a treble crochet. Doing the same thing what I did here. I mean making two chains. One, two, two times yarn over. Inserting our hook at top of this treble crochet. Two chains making. Going here. Making a treble crochet, two chains making, two times yarn over, inserting our hook in there, making another treble crochet, like this. And we are coming to the end like this, dear friends. I came to the end, there is only one space left. I am making two chains. Two times yarn over, one, two. I am inserting my hook at the second one, like this, making a treble crochet, and this row is finished. Now we are making one chain. After making one chain, yarn over, inserting our hook in this last space, and making a half double crochet. Now I am making yarn over, inserting my hook in the same space, and now making a double crochet. Like this. Yarn over, inserting our hook in the same space, this time making a half double crochet again, like this. Now we are inserting our hook in this space, and making a single crochet in there, like this. Now I am turning the crochet, skipping the first one, going to the other, other chain I mean, and making a single crochet, going to the other stitch, making the second single crochet, going to the third stitch, and making another single crochet like this we made three single crochets in there there is another stitch here we are making another single stitch in there like this we finished here we are going to sew up a button here dear friends for this reason we made this now we are making three chains one two and three two times yarn over, inserting my hook at top of this treble crochet, making another treble crochet on this. We are on the third row, dear friends. One, two chains, going to the other, making a treble crochet. Like this, we are coming to the end of these treble crochets. Here, come here. I finished like this, dear friends, the three rows. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven chains making, two times yarn over. I am inserting my hook at top of this treble crochet in the middle and making another treble crochet. It's been like this. And making seven chains. One, two, three, four, five, 
6 and 7 2 times yarn over inserting my hook at the top of this treble crochet like this 2 chains 2 times yarn over making a treble crochet on top of this previous treble crochet like this we are coming to the end dear friends now i came to the end of this row there is only one space left i am making one two three chains chain one chain two i'm skipping inserting my hook in the chain three yarn over pull through and making a slip stitch like this dear friends now i am making six chains one two three four five six and here inserting my hook and making a slip stitch in there like this making one chain i'm making one more chain to fix well and here i am cutting the yarn i'm going to hide this yarn and in the same way what I, did, what I did here on the web it is mainly finished we are going to hide the other yarn ends also uh, hide all the yarn ends as I explained to you dear friends it is nearly finished now the only things we are going to make these ruffles on the fourth row and then we are going to sew up the button now we are going to make the ruffles at the last end I am taking my yarn in my hand making a knot here first I am inserting my hook here here first of all I am fixing and then I am making three chains one two three two times yarn over inserting our hook in this space making a treble crochet two chains making one two two times yarn over inserting my hook in this first space making a treble crochet two chains making two times yarn over inserting our hook in this space and making another treble crochet two chains making two times yarn over this time making a treble crochet on top of the previous treble crochet and a treble crochet making like this making two chains two times yarn over going to the following space making a treble crochet two chains making two times yarn over inserting our hook in the same space like this two chains making making another treble crochet on the following and making a treble crochet it's going on like this dear friends make like this till here i came here by making the ruffles and i am making two chains two times yarn over i am going to make a uh, seven triple crochet in here one here on this treble crochet seventh treble crochet also here first of all make a uh, seven treble crochet in this space let me show you once i already made two chains two times yarn over i am making i am making a treble crochet two chains i'm making two times yarn over inserting my hook in this space making a treble crochet two chains making two times yarn over inserting my hook in this space 
making a treble crochet. I'm not counting this one. One, two, three. It's been three. You are going to make seven like this, dear friends. I made seven treble crochet in there. I'm making two chains. One, two. Two times yarn over. Inserting my hook in this place. And two by two, I'm making a treble crochet like this. Two chains making. Two times yarn over, going to the other space. And I'm going to make seven more treble crochet in here. Here we are making seven treble crochet. I finished seven treble crochet also here. It's been like this, dear friends. Now we are doing the same thing, exactly what I did here on this. I am making two chains, two times yarn over. I am making a treble crochet. Two chains making, two times yarn over, inserting my hook in here making another treble crochet, making two chains, two times yarn over, and inserting my hook at top of the previous treble crochet, two chains, two times yarn over, inserting my hook in this following space, making a treble crochet, like this, we are coming to the end, dear friends, exactly what I did here at the other side. I finished the ruffles also at this side. It's been like this. I am at the end. I'm not making ruffles here because this will be the buttonhole. We are going to sew a button on, on these this stitches. Now I am just making one chain making another chain to fix the well. Our spider web glove is finished, dear friends. You can use these web gloves uh, during Halloween time, Halloween parties, or you can wear this uh, other parties. It is a nice accessorize like this. And we are hiding these yarn ends in the same way I explained to you. Let now I clean the yarn ends, all the sides. Now we are going to sew up the button. I am taking a button in my hand, also my darning needle. I am sewing up the button here on these stitches. For this reason, we are being careful that this is the back side, this is the front side. Turning this, we are sewing up on the front side, dear friends. At the back side, first of all, I am fixing. I sew it up. I am fixing the yarn at the back side. It is finished. Let me wear it for you like this. Okay, dear friends, we came to the end of another project with you. Hope you like this project. Hope you enjoyed this and hope I could explain you very detailed. This is very nice. You can wear these for Halloween time parties, for another parties, and you can wear as an accessorize. It is very nice, very beautiful. Okay, dear friends, I will go on sharing this kind of video tutorials in the coming days, please remember to subscribe my YouTube channel, activate the info bell. Please leave like remarks and make comments and share my videos in order to support me for my future video tutorials, dear friends. Thank you so much. See you in the coming videos. <music>